Alright, so we've got seven days to die up and running. I'm on a private game, I guess a single player game. I uh, bring up the editor, and from what I understand, well, actually, hang on. I'm told I have to go into debug mode. Bring up debug mode, everything is set like it should be. Bring up the editor. Backup manager. I go to the level or map that I'm playing. I've got my name in here. Added. I've set as admin. I've set a claim size. Um, do save player. I get the BBB reloading and the BBB reload complete. Close. From there, I go to the prefab editor and I come up on my other monitor. Let me pull it over. From here, go to file, load, commence, seven days to die, into the map, backup, users, bacon and taters, and there's nothing here. that was. It doesn't show anything in here at all. Close that. We've done manual update. All right, point three eight mongoose um, settings. This is where my folder is. That's there. This has been set. Don't know what else do, what to look for, or anything from there. Um, oh crap. But, I built this little base all from scratch on a public server. The uh, admins were nice enough to download the region so that I could try to download it into a prefab. And we were going to load this little hunk of joy into a uh, prefab on our public server so that other people could play in it and see it and whatnot. Took, uh, took quite a bit of time, several several months of work and I've done this all by myself so you can kind of understand why I'm <laughs> really wanting to get this to work so that I can save this thing. And not necessarily to uh, save it for me, but we're going to put loot tables in it and set it up so that everybody can play on it. Raid it with zombies and whatnot. But like I said, this is all done by hand on a public server. Rather proud of it. And it goes all the way up to the max build height that wouldn't let me build any farther. But yeah, um, if you can figure out what I'm doing wrong, or if there's a different version I can try or something of that nature, then by all means, please let me know. Um, I don't know what I'm doing wrong, or if it's something that's just software, or what. Yeah, sorry, taking a second to show off my base, I'm rather proud of it. <laughs> I have yet to have a zombie actually get into my base that didn't originally spawn in it.
of a storage area here. My main room. <clears throat> and the living room area. This is kind of poopy. But anyways, okay, I'll stop. But yeah, every time I bring up the editor, I go into backup, pick my map. I've even done other maps and it doesn't make any difference. I do the save player, I get the same message. Close it, prefab editor. Bring this over. I've tried all these buttons. I don't know exactly what they're supposed to do, but this is how the uh, the tutorials show to do it, so. let me. I think this is it. Sorry, computer's kind of slow. Yeah, this is it. I have also tried starting a fresh server in Navis game. And building one from scratch and trying to do it, and it gives me the same thing. So, I don't know what's wrong. Um, I do appreciate your time and patience with trying to help me figure this out. Um, yeah, that's about it. If nothing else, I just really want to save that building that's in that region. Um, I don't know if someone else could do it for me, or whatever and send me the prefab so 